So now that we've uh, created our vectors uh, from our bitmap images, we do have one problem in that the vectors that we've created are quite large, not the size that we want at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select all the vectors just by dragging my mouse over the entire image, right click, and I'm going to copy these vectors. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this model and I'm not going to save the changes uh, because essentially all I wanted to do was do that bitmap to vector conversion. And now I'm going to open up a new model, setting the size of our model to the size that I choose. In this case, I'm going to set a model size at 12 inches in width, or sorry, 12 inches in height by 12 inches in width, with our origin position in the top left corner, because I'm going to be using one of our general eye carvers. And I'm going to click OK. And once our, our workspace is defined, I'm going to right click, and I'm going to paste that image into our workspace. But as you can see, as I zoom out, our workspace is quite small compared to our image. And so now what I'm going to do is use the transform tool to resize this object from its current size at almost 600 inches. I'm going to reduce it down to 10 inches. I'm going to click apply. And then I'm going to center that object in the middle of our model. And as we zoom back into the workspace, you can see that our object our dragon is now the size that we want it to be, so now we can start creating the machining tool path.